everyone this is Rohit I hope you are good and doing well so today I'm going to show you how to make a video player using LWC in Salesforce so if you are new in this channel so I request you please subscribe my youtube channel Salesforce hunt and hit the bell icon for more updates so you will not miss any kind of updates from my side well so please watch this video until end if you want to learn something new so let's get started without any further delay so now I just logged in into my Salesforce all so here you can see this is the environment so I want to create a application under quick find you have to search app manager so once you search app manager just click on this app manager create a new app lightning app under this app I want to show my video player that's why I'm creating this app application so name you can give any name as you want based on your requirement so right now I'm giving this name like video media right so leave it as it is all the information or all the default setting if you need to change so you can change it like uh, theme color or icons or this logo as well so now just click on the next 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 I don't want to take any kind of item from this application it's it should be as a blank so just click on the next and let me add the system administrator profile on this application click on the save and finish and uh, here you can see our application is created now in the last 21 number you can see this is the lightning application I need to add my app lightning app page under this application right so how to add the page so under here you have to search lightning lightning and uh, app so lightning app builder so under this lightning app builder you have to create a new page of this application and here choose app page click on this next button give the page name let's say video player okay click on the next and uh, I want to take three region or two region based on your requirement you can choose it so right now I'm taking this let's say two region like this click on this finish once you finish it now you can see the two region right so this application is divided into two parts first is here you can see this is the first part and this is the second part now I want to make my video player on that particular places like this here and here based on your need you can drag and drop that particular component and you can use it so for now I don't have any kind of component right now you cannot see any kind of like custom component and inside this custom tab right so I want to create a LWC component under that LWC component I want to add some video tags uh, using HTML5 so you will be see this video player inside this component so for now let me save it and let me activate it so under activation page you can see three variants page setting lightning experience and mobile navigation so just you have to click on this lightning experience you have to search your application so now you can see my application name is media player because we already created this lightning page uh, lightning app right so just click on this add to page and click on this save button and after some time it will be saved and once it will be saved here now you can see successfully activation just go back here and search your application as you created so under this nine dots that is called app launcher click on this app launcher and search your application name so my application name is video media so just click on this video media now you can see here it's a blank page right with header so I want to add my player inside this application or inside this lightning page so how to add it so let me open my VS code and let me create a fresh LWC component and based on this LWC component I will show you the media player or that is called video player inside this page
so let me open my VS code now you can see this is my VS code so I just created one you know uh, component inside this LWC uh, project so if you don't know about this LWC so you can learn my playlist about the LWC so I already created lots of video about the LWC project setup and uh, environment setup as well like decorators track API and wire and lots of things available so you can learn based on your need okay so without any further delay let me create let me create the code for this video player so this is the component name so it's a blank right now it's a by default template is there right so this is vid uh, media here you can see video player HTML video player JS and metadata file so these all files uh, right now it's a empty but if you want to add the code so you can add it so how to add the code let me show you so before that let me upload the video so video source should be comes from a static resource you know very well a static resource in Salesforce so you can store the video inside static resource so how to show the static resource and how to store the video let me show you that one so under this uh, org or under this environment you have to click on this setup button under this setup button you have to search under here that is called static resource so just click on this static resource because I need that uh, video link or video reference from static resource to LWC that's why I'm creating this is static resource so just click on this new and give this video right and choose your file and make it cases control as a public because I need to use this vid media player or video player anywhere that's why I'm choosing this public let me add the video here so now you can see I just added or I just uploaded my video inside this static resource so you can use this static resource in your component so let me open my vs code so under the js we have to use first of all static resource right so if you want to use that video inside this lwc so always give the reference so we can give the reference using static resource url so let me search here that is called static resource so now you can see this is the LWC static resource right so if you need that static resource inside this code so always give the capital name this is the best practice right like video or uh, let me change it like video only right so under here you have to use this video or you can use any kind of things inside this one right so now under here I need to use this video so how to use that so you can create a one variable that is called video like this video URL and just save it so this is the way to give the reference of your video inside this JS file so I want to use this video URL in my HTML so how to use that let me show you here so under this template if you don't know about the HTML5 so you can learn anywhere as you want so I need to add first of all like card so LWC card I need to use this LWC card right so you can search like card here and under this card let me change this hello to video player something like that under here let me remove it and uh, I need to add video tag so if you want to use like video video tag so under this video tag we have lots of things like source right source and uh, you know like controls autoplay something like that I will show you each and every controls from here so just you have to use like video and then after that you have to give like source SRC and then you can see here my video URL coming from uh, this JS to HTML now you can see this one and type should be video mp4 because it's a video that's why you can see that format of this video now once you've done these things you have to give some like with or controls right so if uh, if you cannot see any kind of controls that means you didn't added any kind of control tag here right so let's say let me save it right now as it is and let's see what happened so let me save it 
now you can see successfully deploy let me change the metadata file is expose should be true if you want to expose this component outside of this like project or any kind of you know based on your need you can choose that so let me add the target here so lwc target let me save it and let me deploy this code so once you deploy it now come to the salesforce environment under the salesforce environment you have to open your, your particular lightning page under this lightning page just click on this edit page under this lightning page you have to search under the custom that is called video player so i already created this you know lwc component that's why you can see this custom under the custom video player this is the custom component you can drag and drop anywhere as you want let's say here so once you drag it now let me save it and just go back because we already activate this page that's why no need worry about this so here you can see by default my video is coming here right but it's not play or it will not play or any kind of like controls we cannot see here right so how to add the controls or any kind of like controlling systems of this video and auto play something like that so under my component we cannot see any kind of like controls in under this video tag right so if you want to add the controls so you can use this controls only like controls so you have to use controls like this just let me save it and deploy this code here so once you deploy let me refresh this page here again now you can see all the controls like play timing timeline volume you can increase the volume you can decrease or you can mute the uh, video this is the full screen once you click on this one now you can see the full screen and these all controls you can download this video playback speed means you can normally if you want to make it a video slow normal or fast so you based on your need you can use it by default is a normal you can see here okay and finally picture in picture means parallelly you can work another work right so let's say uh, i want to click on this option now in this side you can see my video automatically here and you can work accordingly or you can work another uh, like we can say that application so parallelly you can work both right so let me play this video now you can see right so this is the picture picture in picture let me uh, give this one and let me play here again like this right so this is a small video that's why you can see only 10 seconds video if you have lots of video so you can make it uh, any kind of storation like storage or you can take the reference from that uh, any third party or maybe like uh, some links okay so right now i'm using static resource but uh, in free version of this developer account it's have only 5 mb capacity so less than 5 mb or up to 5 mb we can upload the video inside this static resource so we have some limitation that's why i'm using only a small video here so now if if you have some requirement let's say i want to make it height and width of this video so how to do that same thing it's a simple just you have to go here and just make it uh, this video height let's say height or you can make it height like 500 or and width as well like width 500 it's a html so it's a very simple you can make it your player like this save it and let me refresh it again and you will be see the output here so now you can see this is a bigger screen here right so let me le uh, decrease the length here let's say 300 let me save it and you can control as you want based on your requirement right so it's a not issue about the like line uh, length or width based on your need you can do that right so basically you can see uh, now it's looking good so just let me play this video right so now this is a uh, much better previously right so here you can see this option you can play you can 
and disable this full screen volume or this three dots and download play we we can handle each and every controls so how to do that let me show so under HTML we have to use this one right so I have this code so let me paste it here that is this one right so these controls control no full screen I don't want to take no full screen no download no playback something like that right so now here under let me add this one okay let me save it and once you save it so and the control list this is the control list so you can control each and everything so just let me save it and deploy this one so now you can see all the deployment successfully done and after some time you cannot see this like uh, options like download playback because I already disabled and also full screen so let me refresh this one so now please observe in the you know in the uh, here you can see this full screen you cannot see as a enable it's a already gray out means this is a disable so you cannot make it your video as a full screen so I already disabled these things and once you click on these three dots you cannot see any download playback something like that options so I already hide it if you hide these three dots so you can also disable these things so under this controls if you don't want to take it this one so let me add that uh, property here that is called you know if you want to d hide all the three dots so we may we will make all the control list as a no download no full screen no playback something like that right and also we have to use like disable one of the property disable picture in picture so that is the tag picture in picture so let me save it and once you save it now you can see successfully deployed and you will not be get these three dots this three dots I'm talking about this three dots because it's having lots of control right so I already hide lots of things but let me hide this uh, three dots as well so once you deploy your code let me refresh it and now you can not see any kind of three dots here okay so based on your requirement you can hide and control all the controls right based on your need also if you need like full screen so just you can remove it because full screen we need the full screen let me deploy this code and once you deploy it so once you refresh you will be see this full screen as enable button so let me refresh again now you can see full screen so it's enabled so based on your need you can enable disable all the controls in HTML5 so I will make another video about like uh, how to get the video resource from the third party right instead of static resource so please keep in touch I will show you that one in upcoming sessions so here let me play this one you can maximize your screen like this right and based on your need so you can make it your video player so that's all from my side so please I request you all please subscribe my YouTube channel and press the notification icon bell icon for more updates so you never miss my, my notification from my channel so till then bye bye take care see ya